Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to recreate an eye look that I was wearing in one of my previous videos. You guys were asking for it and it just so happens to be one of my favorite looks that I have done using my Tiny Marvels palette. And so I thought I would get on today. It is actually today. It is my birthday as I'm filming. I don't know when this is going up. I felt like it was the perfect eye look for my birthday, so I sat down to film it before going out to eat. I hope you guys enjoy this look. Let's go ahead and dive in. I'm gonna start this look off using a Nikia Joy E06 and the shade Tree Hopper. Applying this directly into the crease. Back and forth motions. And then I'll add a little bit more because I'm going to bring it upward. I use Tree Hopper with everything. <laughs> it's one of my favorite shades to just go in the crease or even just as a one and done shadow. I just, I love it. And I'm going to give a little shout out to Nakia Joy. I just, I've really been enjoying her brushes. This one especially, it's like the perfect density, the perfect shape. For me to get into my crease and also blend upward. I love this. The EO6, so good. Next up, I'm going to take Scarab on a MAC 221. This is the original one, the natural hair. So if you, you can use a synthetic one, but if you prefer to have a natural hair brush, the refer number 14, Wayne Goss, number, I believe it's 20, it's 19 or 20, and then you could also use the Nakia Joy. I am kind of buffing this on the outer corner, or pretty much outer half of the lid, and then I am bringing it upward to smoke it out. And then I kind of want to bring this about three quarters of the way in because I'm going to mix it in with the green fire butts. It's gonna be a little bit of back and forth, just making sure that all the shades blend together really beautifully. On a rougher 28, I'm gonna use fire butts, placing this on the inner, I love this color. <laughs> um, I'm placing this on the center of the lid and I'm using these shades dry. You can use them wet if you want to but I prefer to use them dry. And I'm just tapping over the edge of Scarab, going a little bit further in toward the inner corner, and also pushing up into the crease. Like I said, I will be taking my brush with no additional product each time, and I'll kind of you know merge everything together so you get this beautiful, just like gradient. No additional product on that 221. I'm just making sure to blend Scarab into Fire Butts. Refer 21 in the shade Web. I'm applying this on the very inner corner, lightly going over the edge of Fire Butts and bringing this upward. You could use this as a highlight shade for the brow arch, but I don't want to overdo it with the highlight shades today because it's all about the lid. Back in with the 28 that had fire butts on it. Just again, merging and blending. I'm gonna take the EO6 from Nakia Joy. No additional product and I'm just going right around the edges. Lastly, Death Moth on a refer number three. I'm gonna apply this to the lower lash line and then I'm gonna go add on inner rim liner and mascara. I finished off the eyes per the usual with, I keep wanting to say milk boss liner, but black liner on my top inner rim, mascara, and then mask proof. This is the Pat McGrath Labs Liquid Lip in Divine Nude. And that completes everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Let me know if you did by giving a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.